Hello guys, welcome back to Coding Cafe. My name is Muhammad Ali Sher, and now we will continue our work. So open your text editor. So now we will copy this div and we will paste it down below three two times and we will change the ID to center centered and then two and this one will be three and we will change the text so over here we will type what people are talking about and then we will change this to and the next one will be join the conversation so now save this and after the head tag we will open up a style tag and we will remove this type equals to text and now we will design this text for you and trust what people are talking about and join the conversation. So first we will type body and then overflow minus x will be hidden. So this overflow minus x hidden means it will remove this scrolling which remove the horizontal scrolling from the page okay and uh, the next one will be the we will design this center one div so we will type the id and then its position will be absolute and uh, its font size will be 10 px and then a semicolon and after the font size we will move this to the top so we will type top will be 30 percent and uh, left will be 30 percent and then transform transform will be will type then the translate and uh, the first one will be minus 50 percent and the next one will be also minus 50 percent and now we will design this center to div so we will just copy this and we will paste it down below and uh, and we will change this to center 2 and its position will be absolute and font size will be let's change this font size to VW means viewport width and uh, also change this to VW now we will change this to 50% and uh, the left will be 40 and uh, now we will design the next div center 3 so we will copy that code and paste it down below and we will change this to center 3 and its position will be absolute and then font size will be 10 vw and top will be 70 and left will be 30 and then transform will be the same so now if we refresh our page so now here is all of our three text divs so now if we minimize our browser our page is now re responsive so if anyone using this our our web project on tablet or mobile phones they will will see the website like this okay as it is responsive and adjustable so now if we go back to our text editor so after this div the ending div we will open up another div and this div also will have class and class will be row and then now we will remove this div from 
here and we will paste it after this ending div and we will change the class to call minus sm minus 6 okay and then in this div first we will add some style so we will open up a style tag and we will move it a little bit so left will be 8px or percent and in this div we will first display the image or the we will display the logo of our website so the image name is uh, coding cafe logo dot png and this image is stored in our images folder so the image name is coding cafe logo and then we will change its width to 80px and then its height will be also 80px and after this image we will open up a h2 tag and uh, in this h2 tag we will open up a strong tag to make the text bold so we will type c what what's happening in and then a br tag to make the text go to the to the next line and after this br tag we will type see what's happening in the world world right now and after the closing tag of h2 we will add a two br tags and now we will just copy this h2 tag and paste it down below and uh, we will change this text to sign up no no not sign up we will just remove this we will type join coding cafe today yeah and we will change this h to take to h4 and we will remove this br tags so now if we save this and now just refresh our page so now our page is now looking more beautiful and amazing so if we so if you like this our images uh, so you can download these images and uh, the link will be in the description down below so after this h4 tag we will open up a forum and uh, in this forum we will its method will be post and uh, not accept action action will be equals to null so now we will create a button for the sign up so this button will have id id will be equals to sign up and uh, class will be btn btn minus info this is the this btn btn minus info is uh, is the class for the buttons okay so this info means it will change the color button to the deep blue sky and then we will type btn minus lg means button minus enlarge and then its name will be sign up and we will type sign up and then to be our text cool so now if we just copy this button so copy this button and then paste it down below and change this to sign in and we will also change the name to sign in and that's it let's change this sign in to login login and its name will login and uh, its id will be also login so now we will add some php code lines so if the user click on the sign up button we will redirect them to the sign up.php file okay so we will 
type php and uh, then we will add an if condition and in this if condition we will type if i set and then dollar underscore post and then if the sign up button is clicked okay the sign up button is clicked then what we will do we will just type echo and uh, the script tag and this script tag we will type window dot open sign up dot php we will create the sign up dot php in the later videos so don't worry for now and then underscore self and now just copy this php lines and paste it down below the login button and change this to login and then we will redirect them to the signin.php file we will create both of these file in the later videos and now let's design these two buttons so scroll up in this h1 tag type st uh, style and then color will be white so after the center 3 tag we will design the sign up button so the sign up button has the sign up name and uh, its width will be 60 percent and border radius will be 30 px and after the sign up button we will design the login button so its name is uh, login no its id is login and then its width will be also 60 percent so its break background color will be hashtag and then fff and border radius will be 1px solid and then this 1da1f2 and color will be also the same and border radius is 30px so now let's make the login button hover okay so we will type over here login and then the hover property and its width will be so its width will be 60 percent color will be fff and background color will be fff and color will be 1da 1f2 and border border will be 2px solid and then the same color and border radius will be 30px and now we will design this well class okay this div so over here we will type dot well and uh, then we will type its background color will be hashtag and then one eight seven capital f a b and now if we save this and refresh our browser so refresh it and here is our main.php file for our social media or social network website so now it's look fantastic and pretty i mean this is incredible not the incredible cartoon just kidding guys so now if we minimize this browser so if anyone use our website on a tablet then it will look like this okay so this is responsive and guys this is it, it for this videos uh, video and in the next video we will work on the sign in.php and sign up.php page so subscribe our channel coding cafe and bye for now